So the first thing we did uh, was release the NAV admin this week uh, to look in the short term, which is to cover down on the MAP process for this, this fiscal year, which starts this summer in the next few weeks. Uh, and the only real change inside that NAV admin for this, this year is going to be the ability for our commanders in, in the fleet to uh, use unused quotas uh, for the MAP program. Longer term, we're looking at expanding the numbers and the scope of MAP uh, to even include shore commands around the fleet. Uh, and today we've got working groups uh, underway that include the TICOMs and the fleets, as well as MCPON and leadership mess to make sure that we get it right. And uh, so that work is ongoing. Uh, but I want to make sure everybody understands that whatever we do inside a map, our focus is going to continue to be on manning the fleet. And I think you'll find that uh, as we expand map and give more authorities to commanding officers to make smart decisions about their workforce, uh, at the end of the day, we're going to continue to be able to man the fleet at the levels we have today.